Hi everyone, we are drawing the basic crab. Maryland is very famous for its crabs and most Marylanders enjoy eating crab cakes. Um, so it looks complicated, but it's quite easy. So follow along and let's draw a crab. So we're gonna start with a, um, a fan shape. So it's a curved line over here. And let's bring this down a bit and then diagonal this way and diagonal this way. I'm going to erase this extra bits of lines. So Maryland is famous for its crabs. Okay, so the the top, we're going to change it. Instead of having a very smooth line, we're going to add just a few bumps to make it a little more realistic because crabs are never completely smooth. Okay. Now a crab has eight legs and all the legs come from the body at the bottom here to create them and make them look symmetrical somewhat symmetrical i am going to just draw simple lines on the side and that side and then straight those curve up and the next set is straight then it curves down ever so slightly and down this way. So we have six claws or legs and this curves down like this. Make these uh, legs a little bit thicker before we start drawing in the segments. Another pointy at the end. I didn't know, did you, that um, some of the legs are for walking and the others are swimming legs. I don't know which are the walking and which are the swimming. That is something to find out. Um, okay. Now we're going to add in the segments. There are four segments, around four segments for each leg. And they are longer in the beginning. And then they kind of become shorter and shorter. So it looks like I started not long enough, but that's okay because I'm going to end it right here. Do you see I'm trying to make it looks kind of rectangular but not perfect. Not perfectly rectangular. Now you know that we are drawing the exoskeleton of the crab. That means that the skeleton is on the outside of the crab's body. So just kind of kind of rectangles, but not perfect.
Sorry guys, I seem to have cut out a clip by accident. Um, let's spend some time looking at the, the claws and the pincers. Take your time. Let's pause the video over here and do the next few steps on your own. I just noticed that um, I didn't have enough space in the view of the camera for the pincers, so I'm drawing them again for you. All right, so that's the way it is. Give you a second look.